What's up everybody, this is that bearded tech guy here with another video. And right now I'm gonna unbox the Pro Beats, Power Beats Pro. Yeah, said it backwards, so what? All right, so reason why I went and got these because the Samsung Buds, they were hot trash. I mean, could nobody hear me on the phone call? The music was too low and I could hear all the noise around me, which I don't mind, but it was just too much. There was like absolutely no noise cancellation whatsoever. So let's go ahead and open these bad boy up and see uh see what they look like. You can operate it on Apple TV, iPhone, iPad, and also Android. So that's a plus. I can use this on all my devices because I do own all of them. They got this thing sealed up like Fort Knox. Hold on, wait a second. All right, silly me. <laughs> I could just pull that top part off there. It's a box within a box within a box within a box. All right. There they go. Beats, big ass case. I don't know how I feel walking around with this big case in my pocket. Not like my AirPods, the AirPods are much smaller, but these are supposed to be the best of the best. Oh, these things look nice. I don't know if y'all remember the other Power Beats 3s, but those headphones were great, but after a period, long period of time, they would start to break and chip and do all sorts of weird shit. These right here look pretty good. So let me there, charge them up. They're ready to go. They're ready to pair. So let's pair it up. As you can see, when you automatically open up, it acts to sync with your iPad, iPhone, but it won't act to sync on the Samsung device because it's it's Android compatible, but it's dedicated for Apple because Apple now makes the uh, the Beats lineup. So let's go ahead and pair it up. I'm going to use my uh, iPhone 7 here. Recorded with the 10 right now. So let's go ahead and pair it up. Connecting. Got a little bit of juice on this trap the box. There they go, all mad connected. Let's pop them in and see what they sound like. Let's see what we got here. Some good old 112. Okay. So far, so good. Kind of loud. The bass on the beats are awesome. Man, I miss that quality sound. Get the same quality sound with the AirPods, but with the Beats, just flat out premium. All right, those sound good. Man, okay, well, there they go. Power Beats Pro Wireless. Got it for 250 bucks plus tax from Best Buy. Kinda expensive, but so far, it definitely works for money. They link up with any of my Apple devices. So let's see how to pair them up with the uh, Samsung. Yeah, because I want to use it on both phones. Put these back in here. 
Now, to put these back in is kind of weird. I don't know how these things sit in here. Just got a little battery on my phone, but who cares? I guess that's how it goes. Yeah, that's how they sit in there. Make sure you hear that click because the magnetic. Sit it down in there, click in, right in place, and start charging, which they're doing now. All right. So let's see how we link them up to the Galaxy. I don't know what the hell all those devices are, but. Let's see here. Hold down the pairing button. Power Beats Pro, pairing up now. Let's see if we get the same quality out of Power Beats Pro out of the iPhone we do the Samsung Galaxy. I go to Warner for increased volume, be safe on all levels. It's pretty neat, so we can blast your eardrums out. Yeah, I'm being clumsy right now. All right, let's see what we got here. Man, whoo, these things sound bad. Man, when I mean bad, I mean bad isn't good. So, so far, the Power, Bo Power Beats Pro, I'm getting tongue tied here, is a definite, definite, definite good buy. 250 bucks at Best Buy plus tax. And also, when you purchase these, you get three months free on uh, Apple Music. So, yeah, go out and grab you some. Right now, these are the hottest headphones on the market. And so far, I like them better than the pods. Not the pods, I'm sorry. The uh, buds. The buds, they absolutely, positively suck. I don't like them. There's no bass to it. There's no nothing. Just sound like somebody talking in your ear when you listen to your music. All right, so played around with them for a little bit. So, yeah, these are pretty, pretty damn good. They fit in your ear nice and tight. They won't fall out when moving around. I just got down, did a couple push-ups with it, a couple of jumper jacks, and man, they, they hold tight. Also, too, the music functionality part of it. Each side got physical buttons you can rarely see, but you could tap them. There are physical buttons sitting right here on the side. Up or down volume as well. As you can see, they got the up or down rockers and the physical buttons. So you tap once to pause right you double tap to skip the track and you triple tap to go back so that's pretty cool right there that way you're gonna mess around with your phone while you're working out so you skip the track you don't like it triple to go back double to go forward pretty cool so these are the beats pro power beats pro and they're worth every penny. Once again, these are 250 bucks. A little bit expensive than more expensive than AirPods, but they're definitely worth it. And I like the fact that it doesn't have that AirPod look with the damn 
like a Q-tip, something hanging from your ear. I mean, they're good quality headphones, don't get me wrong, but I don't like the look of them. So yeah, these are it, legit. Like them, go get them.